<clears throat> Garth Malka. No, it's all right. I won't start with Irish. How are we all doing? Oh, right. Yesterday, I was taking a chill. Because I don't know if you heard me yesterday, like in the last stream, where I was like, you know, I need to just not, like, stream this for a bit. And I even waited till this part of the day. Definitely because I wasn't doing anything else. I actually can't remember what I was just doing today. But anyway, I had to delay it until now. Oh yeah, I was that's what I was doing. I was watching Steinscape, because fucking hell, it got so interesting, like, after a certain point. Fuck! We've already started and we're already going. Okay, cool. I love this game. Gonna have to get used to the game again. <laughs> that jump is gonna be so annoying. Oh! Oh, you... No. Nah. Oh, no, it will. No, please! By the way, sorry for delaying this stream. I was actually going to stream sooner, but fucking KSI and shit uploaded and I had to watch it, and now I'm falling. Let's go! Honestly, like, KSI and Logan have done a good job at advertising their drink inadvertently, like, with just not having much supply. Because I desperately want to try a bottle now. Even though it probably won't come to Ireland for, like, a long time. Unless, like... Unless, unless like, the Asda in Northern Ireland sells them. Oh yeah, that reminds me, welcome back to another episode of the Jump King Podcast, where I struggle to play this game whilst just talking about random shit every so often and losing my marbles. I'm your host, Joseph Flyer, and yeah, that is all I have to say. Oh my god. <laughs> Brother. But yeah, other than this, not much is really happening right now in life, I'm not gonna lie. There's, like, not much to talk about. Like, the concept piece that I'm getting done next is, like, still in production. I haven't really edited Sherry Arbors in a bit because, obviously, I was out yesterday and all that. Um, I was obviously watching Steins Gate just before me dinier. Oh, God. Then yeah, obviously, there's just nothing else for me to mention. I have been thinking, though, recently... I might actually have to start, like, cutting a bit with Sherry Albert's story. Just so I can actually, like, progress it, like, faster to actually get it to be released next year at some point. Because I feel like, with the way I'm doing it now, it's going to be so long before it ever comes out. Like, ah, that was way too much. And I'm not saying I'm going to, like, cut story content and stuff like that. It's just, like, I, I guess you could just call it, like, bonus content and whatnot. I could always include that other shit anyway back in, like, like later volumes or its own thing anyway. It also will help, like, reduce some costs as well for various things, so... But then again, right now I don't really need to reduce too much cost for things. It's just like, in case something major happens in my life and I need a lot of money to help combat it, you know? <coughs> mm. This is pain. But yeah, uh, follower star eyes, they'll stay till 16th, I think it was. Yeah, 16th. There's something happening on the 25th and I can't remember what it is. Oh, it's uh, now I know what it is, never mind. Because I, I was like, YTP, what's that? It's like, oh yeah, because YouTube Premium like automatically renewed when I thought I turned it off last. So I'm going to have to just... I think I already turned it off, though. I don't think I need to turn it off again. But I have it written up anyway in case I do. Even though I should have done that by now. Oh, Jesus, man. This is just going to be a repeat of the last Jump King, sc s s Jump King stream. There we go. But yeah, all I can say about Stein's Gate right now is mad revelations are happening. And I think I'm nearly on episode 20, I think. I think I was on like 17 to 19. 
It's pretty good, honestly. I like the whole, like, the way they're, like, handling time travel and stuff. But I'm not gonna lie, lie. like, partway through, I actually got vibes of, like, fucking <laughs> re-zero with what they, uh, made in the show. Again, I won't say too much about it in case you haven't watched it yourselves. Nah, too little. I could just tell. Too much. Oh, I thought that was too little, honestly. <sighs> you know, like, it's a weird... It's a weird kink to have, to fucking keep playing this game after it spits in your face so much, honestly. Because that's what this is. This is just torture. Why am I subjecting myself to this? And again, all those other times I was saying, yeah, I'll never play, like, DLC. I really mean it. Like, I'm not playing that DLC. I don't care. I'm playing main game, saying that I could, like, at least have the bragging rights to say I can, like, beat Jump King. And then I'm never going to touch the DLC. Unless there's a big reason for me to do it. Like, maybe a charity thing. That would be, like, one of the only other reasons I would. Not even a follower goal could subject me to the, like, Like, I will exclusively write out Jump King DLC. Okay, wait, no, I'll play, I'll still play it for a stream, but I won't complete it. Actually, now that I think about it. Because, uh, okay, like, honestly, I, I was kind of like, okay, wait, maybe I won't do that. Because, like, follower goals are important, you know? They shape the model, shape what's on my model, which actually, speaking of... Because every time I do this, it always, like, I never, like, uh, props. Okay, hold on, let me look at the camera, make sure it's on my face right. There we go. Um, I wish I could save it, though. I'm just going to click go S. I don't know if that did anything, but it made me freeze for two seconds. There we go, that's better. Because I deserve this. <laughs> I, I, for as long as I play this, wait, inventory? Tap, inspect. A trendy and fashionable... Oh, wait, sorry. Let me actually show you the screen. A trendy and fashionable head ornament. It's equipped right now. Objective gets to top. I, how have I not... It's taken me five streams to realize there's an inventory. How? That is so weird. Oh, why did you not go all the way? You're such a weirdo, like... Oh, actually, no, hold on, double, uh, double check, double check. Okay, no, we're good. I thought it was for a minute there, it was using the webcam. Oh, Mike. And I thought I would have to switch over. I think the stream's quality might slightly improve, because I am getting a new, uh, oh, shit. I am getting new, like, thingy adapters so that my computer connects to the internet a bit better because the current one i have like i'll just be like casually watching a show or youtube and it'll just randomly start like flicking out and like buffering basically when like i'm so used to it just not buffering after a certain amount of time and i feel like it has something to do with the plug because the plug itself feels a bit loose and like another thing that supports that theory that it's probably the plug is the fact that when i got the box it was actually like well look bashed slightly the box. I think I took a picture of it ages ago and put it on Twitter, so, yeah. Oh, sorry, another thing I need to do now. Because I don't know if I'm going to do this all the time. But, recently, my YouTube channel actually got access to, um, uh, posts. So, the Joe Snipe Flyer channel, which is mad. Okay, can I stop these other things from loading? I guess not. Oh, bro, I'm sorry. I'm already looking forward to the end of this stream because fucking Spy Family's out today. Oh, that's gonna be such a good watch. I love the intro so much. The intro to Spy Family, like, reminds me of what it would be like if the show had, like, a movie or something like that. It just gives me movie vibes for some reason. And this is not loading. I don't know why it's not loading. It is just not loading. Who is this? Let me X those out before I accidentally leak those. Damn, that took forever to get rid of. Okay, I guess I'm just going to fucking not do this. Wait. Hold on. When in doubt, phone about. So I can do it on my phone as well. 
It's just like now that I have this ability, I may actually use it to uh, do things. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Make sure this thing playing loud. Oh wow! If I I actually just accidentally click into a song, starts playing it, gets DMCA'd. Uh, oh yeah, I can just click the plus button, create a post, uh, text live on Twitch. But it's fair to say, like, if you follow the YouTube channel, they like watching the vods and stuff. Oh wait, that's wrong link. <laughs> Twitch dot TV. Where's slash there slash slash Joseph Noit La Right now. And you bet your ass I'm gonna start using that the posting feature as well for a uh, thing. Wait, can I post? I don't know why it's at, why does it ask me to add options? I just oh maybe I select selected thing instead. Hold on, select all, copy, Excel the post, discard, create a post. Yes. Oh yeah, click poll. Just there you go, text. That's it. Share a behind the scenes photo. No, I'm just gonna share this and actually. to share that image so badly. Ah, whatever. Post. There we go. <laughs> it only takes two seconds for me to start abusing a feature that I've been given, like. I need to uh, do this as well, sorry. Just give me a minute. Give me a minute. That's my friend still alive. Hold on. check the twitch thing i don't think bro what is up with my fucking computer man there we go yeah she's still alive so if you are watching this live i wouldn't recommend watching me just just, just watch like lazy panda stream and said lazy panda 53 higher quality content and plus she can sim for her she's a girl oh fuck nope okay wait i need to switch scene again there we go bro Oh, shit. I'm already out of the groove. <laughs> but we will fix that in no time. You mother loving lover. You enjoyer of mothers. How dare you? Oh my god, that. Okay. I think it's time for me to go silent soon. Not gonna lie. And yeah, by the way, I'm not gonna be really streaming anything else when it comes to, like, Destiny 2 and Telesto. I think I'm just gonna wait till the end of the season or the start of next season to start streaming Destiny again. Especially on reset time. Oh yeah, and bro, some fucking bullshit article came out from, like, Bungie recently, right? Where they were like, um... Oh, we don't do exotic missions anymore, or secret exotic missions anymore, because, like, they take too much to encrypt and all this bullshit. Bro, what do you mean? Like, sure, it's expensive, but wasn't that the whole point of, like, what Eververse was doing? Because, like, they mentioned before in the past, oh, yeah, but, like, we use, like, basically the sales of, like, one armor set or some shit to fund the entirety of fucking Whisper, and it's like, bro, how values have changed, like. And, like... I don't know how I feel. Like, honestly, if they do away with exotic missions, like secret ones, and just have exotic missions, like Presage, I don't mind then. That's okay. But if they completely ride out not having, like, uh, exotic missions, or if they start selling them behind a paywall, that's just scummy. That'll legit just be, like, you, like, I don't know if Bungie understand, but, like, even with the amount of content they make people pay for, you still need to give free content to it, like, especially for the people who will never pay for your game, to encourage them to, like, pay for your game at some point because you're being so generous with free content, you know? Nobody wants to give money to a company that's fucking milking the shit out of their game, like. And I guarantee it, something, like, a new Eververse thing will be sold, like, during Lifefall, 
like, a new Eververse stuff. Like, before I think it was the synth weave and all that for, like, fucking armor synthesis. I bet next thing they're gonna do is they're gonna introduce fucking moving emblems, but you can only fucking get them through Eververse and using them, like, silver to buy them. They'll not sell them for Bright Dust, I guarantee it. Like, either that'll happen during Lifefall or another season. <coughs> Sorry. Bungie employees are already talking about assassinating me. But, like, actually, no, sorry. The last thing they started monetizing was the fucking, like, season stuff. The uh, event card. But, honestly, I I kind of don't mind it. It just annoys me that you earn the tickets for the stuff in-game. They're basically copying the Fortnite V-Book challenge system. Which is smart, because, they're, like, they're getting you to fucking grind the game... Even more, even though you paid for something. I feel like if you pay for something for a game, like if it's stuff like that, like cosmetics, you should be able to just pull them on immediately. Why, like, why are you dangling a stick? Like, do you want that person to like stop playing the game sooner? Like, I don't know. Again, all this is coming from a guy who's going to spend another hundred euro on Destiny anyway next year. So, or I might actually be a bit cheaper or scabbier this year. I think I'm only going to pay for um, much of it. Oh shit. I'm only going to pay for Lightfall, and I think you have to pay for the first season, so I'm probably going to play the first Lightfall season, but other than that, I don't think I'm going to pay for the other seasons. Like, if not paying for seasons locks me out of the previous seasons, then okay, I might actually just pay for the 100 euro edition, but like, I don't know, man. This year, I just, I don't know. I want to do something different, you know? And maybe, like, I'll start actually, like, watching YouTubers, like, do, like, the, uh play the story of the game instead or just keep up with the lore channels because like my only games and my name is Bife like do a lot of videos and like what's happening in the game and the lore and all that stuff so. sorry I came in guns blazing today talking about Destiny 2, Bungie all sorts of stuff bringing all that negative energy in I apologise as, as contrast to yesterday when me and my mate shared like a big like sushi uh, like like meal thing. It was massive like. Like there was 10 pieces of, uh, it's not sushi, it's uh, nigari or something like that. And like you, um, what should we call it, there's 10 pieces of those. And then there's also, like, four pieces of normal sushi, where there's two flavor or, like, just two different types. And, like, obviously you have, like, your wasabi, your ginger, and you have, like, the soy sauce that was already on the table. Bro, it was so good. And, like, part of me, like, he, he was saying to me, are you sure you don't want to order more, Joey? Like, you might, like, not get filled. And I'm like, yeah, no, I'm sure. But honestly, part like, I'm not going to lie, once I returned home, I actually went out to get, like, a, a little bit of an ice cream. <laughs> I was like, actually, I do need a tiny bit more food in me. Even though I could have just waited until I got home, but I've been, I was dying to try this particular ice cream. Let's just say that much. And let's just say he was right. Like, I, I should have actually got, like, a bit more, but I don't know. But, man, honestly, the, the like, the more I have sushi, just the more I want it, like. But I know for a fact, if I start having sushi on the daily, I'm going to learn that I hate it, like, or it's going to have adverse effects on me just eating sushi. Maybe I'll actually grow more brain cells, and that's what I'm scared of. Because, <laughs> like, fish is meant to be good for you, and that shit. Meant to make you brainy or some shit. I don't know if it's true, but, I mean, I should be eating more fish more often. I should just become pescatarian. Like, I eat my veggies, and I eat fish only. But then again, I just had steak today, and I just thought about the thought of, like, not having to eat that, and I'm sorry, but, like, I am still going to eat my steak. Oh. That's handy. Um. But, yeah. Obviously, though, in the future, if they do have, like, lab-grown meat and shit, and, like, if I can afford it, like, when they make it commercially available, I'll probably, like, eat that more instead of, like, even over, like, organic beef and all that, just because, like... You know, if you're growing in a lab, you're not really hurting any animals, you know? I don't know. At least that's what I've read up on so far. 
Like, I'd say the initial thing that would just hurt the animals, probably, like, I guess, like, extracting the DNA from them, but yeah. But there'll probably still be a market, though, to sell, like, actual thing. Because, uh, like, when you think about it, fucking, like, meat farms would just fall apart if, like, or, like, yeah, no, meat farms. Meat farms would basically just fall apart. Oh, my God. If you just started selling lab-grown meat at reasonable prices, like. Because you probably would even have some vegans, like, hopping back in and be like, you know what, actually, I'm going to eat this because it's, uh, like, technically hurting the animal and all that. But I'd still say, though, for a while, like, I don't think, like, plant-based milk is going to take over. Like, normal milk. I think normal milk is just a staple for another, like, century or two. I say that, but watch it not be, like, literally tomorrow. <laughs> just tomorrow, they're like, alright guys, we're banning all just normal milk. Have fun with just the, uh, plant-based. I'm not saying plant-based is bad, but, like, I don't know, with my system right now, it doesn't really fully agree with it. Even though I still will drink it, like, I've had vanilla milk before, and I've mixed it with G Fuel. And the only problem is, though, like, I don't have it with G Fuel, even though, like, I like to buy my own milk when, like, um, having G Fuel. Like, I just can't, like, have, um, whatchamacallit, I can't have vanilla thingy milk just because, like, it just froths up in the bottle too much. Like, that's my only pet peeve of it. If it didn't froth up so much, I would have it a lot, like, so much more. But then again, it is kind of sickly having both them on the morning. Like, this, like, the nice flavor of G Fuel and the sweetness of the vanilla, like, it's a bit much. Like, I'd like them separately on the morning, but, like, not together, you know? And I only really have G Fuel in the morning because, like, energy. I always have, like, I always, well, I mostly have caffeine stuff at the end of it, or at the start of the day. Because I know if I have it at any other point during the day, it's just going to be pain. Especially when I, like, have it before going to bed. I will just not sleep. Even though, like, that would actually give me an opportunity to just stay up all night and just do random shit, but I don't know. I do enjoy the thought of sleeping. But if I'm being real here, and I'm being a bit depressing recently, I've just been actually just chilling in bed a lot more than, like, getting up immediately. I don't know if that's a bad or a good thing, though. Because in a sense, yeah, I'm enjoying myself. I'm just, like, resting a bit longer in bed. But, like, I mean, I'm already awake. I'm already ready, basically, to start the day. But, like, I just kind of just sit there in bed and I just, I guess, just daydream a bit more until I get up. But at least for now, I think, like, the reason... I do it is because like I know I don't have to be ready for anything if I knew okay I need to be up by like you know thing o'clock I would probably get up by then but then again for me like my dad is my alarm clock basically for stuff like that I don't even have my alarm clock out anymore just because it uses electricity like that <laughs> I'm just like right if my PC is going to be using a lot of electricity we're going to cut down on things in this room that do and obviously my fan Actually, is my fan... Yeah, no, it's not. I'm gonna unplug it from the wall, though. Because, I'm gonna be real with everyone, I'm not gonna need my fan for, like, another few months now. And I say a few months, because, like, just watch January be blistering hot for, like, no reason, like... Huh. <sighs> Damn, I actually got a lot off my chest there, I'm not gonna lie. And that's what it's like here, the jump cast... Jump cast. Ah, yeah, jump cast. Jump cast podcast. Instead of jump king. Because I'm technically not a king. Not yet. Someday, I may do it. Just not today. I'm just not gamer enough. I need more G fuel. <laughs> it just, just, like, doesn't abide by my own rules and just gets more G fuel right now. I'm tempted to just have G Fuel again with water, but like, I just, I, honestly, I just, it's just me being weird. I just prefer it with milk. Like, even if you gave me something that's preferenced in water, I'd probably still drink it in milk. Because I'm just that strange, you know? I'm just that quirky, you know? Like, this is what, it's what happens to you when you become a VTuber, you know? You have to have quirks. And you have to be, like, wholesomely horny sometimes as well. But I feel like I can't really pull that off as a, like, male VTuber. I don't know. I'm, I'm just being sexist against myself. So 
too low. <laughs> I love that. How he just slides down. He just stands up on his two feet instead of, like, plateaus on his face. Ah, oh, God. Imagine... That'd be an interesting streamer. A streamer who streams to talk about other streamers and link people to other streamers. There probably is someone out there on Twitch doing that, like, right now. Like, that's their whole spiel. They just don't have a lot of followers. Oh, fuck. They just don't have a lot of followers, so, like, not a lot of people know about that kind of thing. One day, honestly, like, maybe even today, if I get bored of doing this, I might actually just start watching videos. Because why not, you know? Fuck it. I don't think Twitch will really care too much if I'm streaming, like, copyright and content, as long as they can, like, mute and block it. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, we're good. Because I'm not going to lie, I was watching, like, um, a VTuber stream recently, and, like, I just noticed how parts of the stream was just, like, muted out. And I don't know if that was on Twitch end or, like, YouTube's end, but, yeah. The stream basically, like, I checked even, like, description. It doesn't say that this, like, a song was copyright claim in the stream, so, I don't know. Maybe I was just a bit too paranoid. I am a bit too paranoid about just watching content on Twitch. Because it also comes down to, like, am I going to provide enough commentary? Am I going to be good enough to commentate on this shit? Or nah, you know? I was also looking at Twitch extensions recently. I need to get, like, more Twitch extensions. I know there's one where you can, like, play games with viewers in real time. I'd really like one that, like, gives you a point system and allows you to, like, interact with the stream that way. Even though I know points, I think, are kind of more of an affiliate thing than, like, just a random streamer thing, but I don't know. Twitch would probably already ban an extension like that anyway. They don't want affiliate features going out to peasants like me. We hit a goal recently on Twitch. I can't remember what it was. I got an achievement or something, or an advancement, whatever it was. Again, I can't remember fully what it was, but I think it was something like, Oh, you progressed on this. Good job. Because as I've said before, like, I basically can be affiliate. It's just like, I'm just not good at attracting a fan base. I am shocking at that. Oh, fuck. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay. I thought I was going to keep going. I'm not going to lie. You know what? It's all right. As I said before, 20 seconds when everything ends. I need to get to work, honestly. There's still videos I want done before the 22nd. Like, before I know it, it's going to be, like, December. I'm like, oh, shit. I should actually, like, finish some of these videos, like. Especially things like the Highlights 2022, because I don't really think there's going to be much more videos I'm going to upload, honestly. Because <laughs> after 20 seconds, I just become a streamer slash TikToker. Oh, my God. <laughs> you can just hear the actual relief in my voice. But watch, I'm going to fuck it up. Okay, I need to get over there without hitting Tang. Okay. Ooh, okay, wait. If I go here, that's it, okay. And then I believe you hit that. We finally returned to the Great Frontier. Holy shit, we've returned. I, how, how, uh, how, what do I do? What do I do? Guys, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I don't, I actually don't know what to do. I'm scared. I'm legit scared. I don't know what to do. <sighs> Wait. Okay. Predicted. Oh my god, what am I doing? Huh? Go mena sigh? What is this? What do I do? Can I slide down the slope? I don't think I can actually. I'm not gonna even try it. What the fuck am I meant to do? I'm actually so confused. 
Can I hop over? Fuck no. Actually, you might. Alright, you only live once, Joe! Okay. My heart. My fucking heart. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, I need to get on that. Don't I? You fucking troll. No! Okay, they saved me up here. They saved me. I'm, I'm thankful. I'm very, very thankful. Oh, no! You... Oh, you... Oh. Well, back down below. Back into town. Oh my god, that's depressing, honestly. That is majorly depressing. That was the highest we reached, by the way. So, like, I I'm good now for today. <laughs> it's just like, the rest of this is just filler now. Oh my god. I need to remember how long I'm pressing it for and how far I go. Because I'm clearly not remembering that right. Boom, boom, boom. Honestly, if Sonic Frontiers ever goes on offer, I need to buy that. Just so I have like a Sonic game to play. Fuck. I think, yeah, it's, I think it's legit. I keep saying this to myself and I keep forgetting it. Don't press a button when you go over. Just let it happen, like. I'm not gonna lie, by the way. Fucking recent, like, My Hero season is so good, like. Like, shit is popping off right now. In My Hero Season 6. Not too much. Called it. Ah, no! Glit. Uh, oh. Whew. All it takes is rigorous training, just like this. Honestly, if I ever see a fucking, like, Jump King compilation ever again, I need to just watch it just so I know their pain. Like, when they fail at certain parts and whatnot. But I'm only going to do that when I finish, because, like, I don't want to spoil the rest of the game for myself. Even though I kind of know what the top already looks like and what leading up to top might look like, unless it's a DLC area I'm thinking of, but yeah. Uh! But if it is how I think it is, then it's going to be fucking brutal. That's all I'm going to say. Like, it is just... <sighs> it is not going to be nice to me. Not too much. Oh, no, it's just right. I think there was a factoid. Or, I don't know why I'm remembering this randomly. But I think it's like, if you're born in November, you were like a Valentine's baby or some shit like that. Nope, too much. Not even going to let me be in the church. Oh, not even going to let me be up there either. And the reason for that is like, if you count, like I think nine months out from it, it's meant to be thing. What am I doing? One day I feel like I'm just gonna snap. I'm gonna be like, you know what, actually, why the fuck am I doing all this? I'm just gonna not do it. I'm gonna just delete all these channels. Just fuck everything, like. Oh my god, definitely after that moment I feel like that now. I don't know why. I have this weird, suspicious feeling that YouTube are just going to verify me on, like, my 10th anniversary. And I'm going to be like, shit, well, I, I kind of feel a bit obliged to, like, still use the channel. Even if it's just for posts. Because I feel like... Oh, shit. I feel like that should be a fair assessment, right? Like, if you've had a channel since 2010, or not 2010, since, like, um, like 10 years... Or four or ten years that, like, they would give you verification for that. Just to show, like, how long you've been on the platform and how loyal you've been. I don't know. It depends on a few things. Well, especially, if, like, 
what security you have and what details you've given them before as well. Like obviously for like getting YouTube Premium with the student deal, I had had to give them my like uh, student card. So like it would make sense if they already knew who I was in a sense. It's kind of scary though. Oh yeah, no, I already mentioned about the internet thing. I was actually going to start talking about that again, but yeah. All I'm going to say is, if I pay fucking, like... If I pay nearly, like, actually, basically nearly 100 quid for this new shit and it's not good, then I'm going to cry. I'm just not going to be able to install it straight away, though. I'm hoping it comes on, like, a um, Wednesday or Thursday, because that's the days the, like, house is less busy and I can actually rearrange the, uh, like, plugs. So I have to replace the one, like, beside the internet, like, modem as well. Because, like, the way it works is, like, you plug one into one wall, and then you plug the other into the other wall. And obviously, if you want a third, you can buy, like, extras probably by themselves, and it would still work. I don't know if, like, different plugs are cross-compatible or not, but I feel like it should make sense if they were, right? What am I doing, by the way? Am I alright? Not too much. We were so much higher, so high. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, fuck, no. Oh, whoa. Can I get much higher? Probably not. But yeah, no, honestly, the one stream I was going to do on YouTube, the uh, watching VTubers kind of stream. Or, no, what the title was, um, VTuber goes down the VTuber rabbit hole, that's it. Just because I thought it'd be a funny title. Oh my god. And it's like one of the only times you actually see my model in the thumbnail. I need to incorporate my model more into my thumbnails, honestly. Because even now I'm kind of still just lazing on it. Ugh. Tisk. No, too much. It's always at the last second. Ha! Ah, I didn't fuck up that time. Let's go. I'm learning. Machine learning algorithms are on point today. You gotta respect, like, the, like, the idea of a game like this. Be like, okay, we're gonna make a game, but what is it gonna be like? Okay, it's gonna be about this knight that, like, jumps a lot, and, like, he has to jump up platforms, and it's gonna be, like, Dark Souls difficulty. And, like, you have to be pixel perfect with your jumps and you're holding your jump, or else you fucking fall five years. Huh. Let's do that. And let's give it a DLC in the future. And let's incentivize people by putting a hot babe at the top. Let's go. I'm holding too much when I get there. Now, fuck. I fucking knew it. My wrist is already hurting. My wrist is weak. And obviously it's the left hand. It's always left. That's like, bruh. That's like why when I go to the shop, I always like... When I'm carrying a shopping bag, I will use my left arm on purpose because I know my left arm's a weak ass bitch. And I need to strengthen it up more. Oh, wow. Game, I wasn't talking about you. You didn't have to take it out on me. Like, fucking hell. I was talking about my own arms, like. If you're getting offended on behalf of my arm, then, bro, like, come on, like, chill. Why am I... St I don't know why I'm stopping it per way through for. I'm such a dunce. Ah, I can't take it anymore. Honey mustard with no... Mustard. Honey burger with no mustard. Honey burger with no mustard. I think that's how it goes, isn't it? Oh my god, what am I doing? Brother, 
Can I at least, like, make it back up to the black brick section? What was it called? Something Frontier, wasn't it? Definitely wasn't Final Frontier. Actually, watch it be Final Frontier. Or Frontiers. Too much. You know, <laughs> one stream we need to just go to random people's streams and just donate, just see their reaction. So I can make content out of them. Oh yeah. What, you think I'm a good Samaritan? You think I actually want to be nice to people? Bro, no. I am here for your reaction. And if you don't give me a reaction, I will cuss you out. That'd be a good, like, Christmas stream, though. Ugh. Ah! What are you doing? Where are you going? Where are you going, brother? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm gonna actually be a good Samaritan. I will do it this time, game. Please, I swear. Just let me back up, I swear. No! Oh, where are you going? I f that was the first time I've actually done that. I'm so annoyed at myself. I knew it was going to happen at some point, but like, that was before I like stopped falling down here so often. Like, or that yeah, that was before when I was falling down more often. There we go. Just fixing my English up a bit. All I will say about Sherry Albert's story is like right now I think I just got to edit Volume One again. And then I think, like, at that point, it's just kind of set in stone. Because there is... I know there's a friend that definitely asked for the story back anyway. Because, like, they didn't actually get to check it out. Because I sent it on Discord. <laughs> Instead of sending it through the other means of which I was uh, saying, Oh, yeah, anyone want to read my story? And, like, I don't know. Because, like, if they do get back to us, and they're like, Yeah, this story about this, this, and this. And if they're, like, you know, as, as much of an asshole I'm going to sound... I don't really want to hear, oh yeah, it's a, it's a good story, you should definitely go with it, and then if they don't say anything else, it's like, thank you, I, I'm, I'm appreciative of this, but this ain't criticism. And to be fair, the, none of them are obliged to give me criticism, I just basically was like, yeah, if you want, you can, you don't have to, you know. I already have my own methods in my head and how I'd help somebody else who was going to be right. I would straight up basically write a fucking, like, like essays on the story like basically being like um okay so my friend you see this part of the story this 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 because like it's easy for me to be tunnel visioned when it comes to my own story and thinking oh yeah it's all right like i don't think there's anything else i need to do but then there's going to be something that someone else is going to see and they're like uh joe you know this part actually doesn't really tie with this part or this part is a bit weirdly worded or this that and the other and honestly I'd be like, oh yeah, shit. And now, not to say I'm a big, like, taker of criticism. I I'm a little bitch when it comes to criticism. I fucking hate criticism. But, like, if it makes the story better in any sense, then I'd like to know beforehand, you know? But then again, there's also the point of just, like, actually publishing the story and then seeing what reviews are like from there. Because, like, if reviews start telling me off about thing, thing, and thing, I know I will be pissed, but, like, at least I'll be getting, like, criticisms that's unbiased. You know? Not to say that I won't get unbiased opinions from friends, but... Yeah. I don't know. I just... I really hope, though, that I can get Sherry up. Like, bro, bro, imagine, right? What What's the Christmas gift you're getting people this year? Sherry Arbor story. The first volume. That would be fuck. I, I would do that on purpose. I would gift all... <laughs> I'd ask for all my friends' addresses, <laughs> and I'd just, like, I'd buy a bunch of them, and, no, actually, I wouldn't even buy a bunch of them, I'd buy them separately, but through my, uh, thing, and I'd make sure to put in each of their addresses, and then just send them each a copy of the store, and be like, Merry Christmas, oh yeah, by the way, sorry, I'm broke now, because I bought all these. Bro, no one, would I, though? See, I say, like, knowing me, I would do that, but, like, would I actually do that, though, is the next thing. Like, if a friend was showing enthusiasm for the final version, yeah, maybe I actually would. Um, but, like, if they don't really care that much, then, yeah, no, I probably won't. Instead, I would give them an Amazon gift card with a, a nice letter saying, 
Hey, so you know um how like you helped me with this and how I'm giving you this for Christmas? Yeah, you know, uh, have you ever have you ever considered that buying like the physical edition of my light novel series called Sherry Arbor Story, the first volume to be exact? But then again, it's not even a thing of like um publishing it. It's more of a thing as well. Like I need to make sure I advertise it. I could advertise after it's out, but I think it's better to advertise before it's out because I think Amazon, especially if you self-publish through them, like, your book gets a bit, I think, I, I can't say for certain, but I feel like it might get a little bit of priority because it's new and basically hot, like, and all that sort of shit. Oh, and I'm also thinking as well, like, if I could get the story, like, first volume out before March as well. I, hit, I basically just want to hit up Comic-Con and be like, yo, bros, I, I got this light novel series I'm trying to sell. Do you guys mind if I set up a stall? Like, I, you know, I actually would do that. And if they're like, eh, can you sell more than just your book? I'd be like, okay, gotcha. <laughs> we just make a shit ton of merch. I will find a way. I say shit ton, but I wouldn't even make that much. I'd only want, like, a small table because I'm not that confident in my ability to actually be able to sell stuff. And plus, I'd have to, obviously, like, wear a mask and stuff, which I probably would already be doing if I'm going to Comic-Con, if I'm being real with you. Now, would I even get a hotel uh, in Dublin? Absolutely fucking not. Like, the fucking prices is... Like, honestly, I think about the start of the year, when I went on my little holiday to Dublin, and... Bro, did I really have to pay as much as I did for the hotel? But then again, to be fair as well, I paid a lot for, like, well... Me and my friends paid a lot for hotels when we were in America as well. Around similar prices for less time as well. And less facilities. Because, well, not even less facilities, just less things that we weren't going to use. Oh, but I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm going to start crying now. I'm just remembering the America trip and how good it was. Like, I still can't believe, bro, so much shit has, like... Like, as much as 2022, I make it seem like it's shit, especially because, like, I'm going to be stopping the Joe's Night Flyer channel this year. Like, it's been a good fucking year. Like, so much good shit has come out of this year for me, like... Oh, shit, wait. Oh, whatever. Coming down here was better anyway. Because, like, I look at my room, right, and I'm like, oh, yeah, did I have this light board at the start of the year? Did I have these walls painted at the start of the year? I went to America this year. I went on a holiday by myself this year. I went to fucking Ting like with me for the first time and it's just like <laughs> I became well a VTuber last year but got decent internet this year. The uh, Joe's Night Flyer channel took the lead of all the other channels this year and I don't know. It's just is it 2022 is just a good year. Especially to end on. Um, when it comes down to it as well, I, I revealed Cherry Arbor's story this year, even though I think I, I think I had, um, I was up there as well. I may have revealed Cherry Arbor's story this year, but I think it was like sometime last year when I actually started. I think it, I think it was legit like June 6th or something like that when I actually started it. And then even before then, I thought of like the character names and all that. Which, fun fact, all the characters, like the main characters that are featured, uh, weren't even a part of the original, that, that were a part of the original list of characters, aren't, weren't even like put in thing, which is just mad to me. I think I mentioned it before in a factoid somewhere, but in case I haven't, I'm not going to mention it here. And when I say, by the way, cutting corners to share Albert's story, I mean like, for, I think I'm overthinking the cover, because honestly, like, I, I want a nice cover, but I don't think I should make it as, like, big as I'm thinking of it now. I don't know. I think, honestly, the front cover should legit just be, like, Sherry, maybe. Because my original idea was to have Sherry and Joseph Flyer on the cover, but, like, I think it's maybe better for them to be just separate. And just have Sherry on the front cover. Because, like, that look that, like, Sherry, like, you know, when you see that image of Sherry Arbor, like, my profile picture on Twitch, that look is just so iconic to me. Because, like, the first time I saw that, I was thinking, damn, this is such a good looking, like, um, like, drawing that you would have on the cover of the book. 
just li literally, it's just simple. It's just Sherry holding her hat and staring at the camera. And there's just something about that that's just really cool. Which I think I should just go with that, honestly. There'll be other chances to feature other characters on the covers in the future anyway. I if there is a future, obviously, for sure, Albert's story. Which I do kind of hope there is, you know? Because even if Volume 1 doesn't do well, that doesn't mean I don't have to do Volume 2, you know? I can still do this shit, but, like, I just won't be as heavily into Sherry Arbor's story, like, if it doesn't do well. If it does alright, obviously I'll, like, go with it, and if it does extremely well, I'm going to probably stress the shit out, because I'm like, oh, fuck. No, please, don't do this to me. Like, man, like, honestly, I feel like what would happen is I would panic, I would start editing volume two, and I'd make sure to get the art done for it for the next volume. Um, I'd probably order multiple commissions as w at once as well, especially if it's in demand for, like, the second volume. And, like, I would start, like, actually skimping on stuff, and I would, like, I'd cut some things out, and, well, not in the story itself, but I would just, in general, just, like, cut cord. I feel like I would just be in panic mode and I would do things that I shouldn't do. And then volume 2 would be like shit in comparison. I don't know. I am definitely scared of that possibility. Because when doing things, you think about things in various aspects. Regardless if they're going to happen or not. That's the fucking problem with having a mind like mine. You think of every single fucking possible scenario that happens. That's why, like... Oh shit, why'd I do that? Why'd I do that? Oh no, why'd I do that? Too much. Or too... Uh, yeah. I guess that's why I like watching Steins Gate in a certain way. Because it's like... It's just little changes that change things in the story that, like, it's what I'm always thinking about. It's like, oh, man, that's so cool. Like, imagine this, right? Imagine a future where I actually did use a voice changer and I continued on using the uh, Josie model instead of the Jonesy one. What a different timeline that would be, wouldn't it? And honestly, I kind of, <laughs> I'm thinking of doing that at some point. But, like, actually being, like, open about it, though, and not, like, hiding it. Because there are probably VTubers out there that legit use voice change or not, and then that's okay, you know? But it's like, I don't know, there's a certain degree of like, I don't know, if you're playing a character, it's all cool, but if you're acting like, oh yeah, this is always me, then yeah. But if there's a reason you're doing it, then obviously I'd like to hear that reason, like, and I can kind of already think of reasons why you're doing it. It's like, yeah, hey, yeah, it's not that bad. I don't know, just being honest with people goes a long way, and that's what I'm trying to do as much as I can. I say that, but honestly, the last day, like, I kind of wanted to just, like, the last stream I did, I kind of, like, it's not available now, because, like, I just don't like how the stream ended up. And, like, I don't know, the, like, I should have just told the person, like, nah, sorry, I, can you not advertise on my stream, please? Because it was, it was basically low-key selling, I'm just, I'm being too nice, you know? And obviously, there's a whole conspiracy in the back of my head about things. And, like, yeah, I don't know. I would mention more details, but I just won't mention it right now. Because, again, it's alright to hustle for your business and stuff, but, like, I don't know. I, I if, Maybe I should have shown less interest, like. Because the fun part about my streams is everything, well, not everything, but most things is organic. Actually, no, yeah, well, everything in my stream is organic. Maybe except the poster now. I kind of just saw it on like, Google Images. So I was like, oh, that's mine now. And, like, obviously the model I made through Vroid. I use VC Face for thing. Um, the scrolling text I just made in OBS. Like, it's not even that hard, actually. Like, you know, it'd be surprising, like, how easy you can make things look. Like, I don't know if you've, any of you have noticed, but, like, that one background with Sherry Arbor with a halo behind her, like, isn't actually that hard to make. All I had to do was basically take the normal pink background and just, like, rub it, like, yeah, essentially just rub it out. With, like, a, uh, fading brush. I don't, I don't think that's what it's actually called, but the brush, like, it, it, like, it doesn't paint, like, 
uh, how do I say it? I don't know artist terms. Basically, when you colour with it, it leaves a little bit of a fade in the outside. And that's what I used. Oh my god. No! Fuck oh, I Oh, bro, man. One of the first things I noticed in, like, I think it was even episode one of, like, Steins Gate, is that, like, one of the characters, when, when, she, when she introduces herself or lets herself be known to everybody else, she always goes, like, do do do, and I'm like, bro, oh my god, that's the fucking Twitch alert sound for thing. Like, I swear, in Streamlabs, you can actually set that to be your thing. I think her name is My Your She? Something like that, I don't know. But she always goes like, do do do. And like, it's weird as well, because every time she does it, it's like, bro, she's got it nailed down. She knows how to do it off by heart, like. And obviously, I wouldn't be able to do that, because I'm a man. Like, my vocal range is, is shy. It's just horrible. My voice still cracks. But I, honestly, like, a lot of people are, like, laugh at people with voice crack stuff. I just, I laugh at my, well, not really laugh at myself. I just go with it. I just think it's funny, like. But that's why I'm also scared of being in conversations and heated debates with people and even fights. Because I would probably start, like, saying some decent things. And then all of a sudden, if my voice would go like that, you know. Like, it would just crack. And I'm just like, right, sorry, uh, I am your bitch now. Uh, I apologize for... Causing a commotion. I'm sorry for uh, for this tomfoolery. Uh, you are now free to uh, just do whatever you want to me. Oh, <laughs> oh fuck! I can't believe you've done this. <sighs> oh my god! Don't don't do this to me, please. Just let me back in town, man, please. I, I just want to watch videos now at this point. I don't even want to progress. I already progressed slightly. Like, that's all I needed, like. Like, even just showing a bit of progress is better than none. Because so, honestly, actually, now that I think about it, I don't even think I progressed the last stream, did I? I kind of just gave up. <laughs> I was just like, nah, fuck this. Within good reason, though. I, I think there's meant to be an experimental feature with Twitch that's happening right now where you can, like, where viewers can, like, call in or something like that. It's I think it's, like, Instagram Live, in a sense. I don't know what that would be like, honestly, at all. I don't even know if I trust that. Anybody random could just come in and be like, how's it going? Uh, so today I'm going to commit, like, multiple acts of misogyny, uh, racism, sexism... Ageism, religiousism. I don't know any other isms off by heart. I'm gonna, conf uh, I'm gonna just sit here and perform them all day, and I'm just gonna be there struggling to just get rid of it, like. But I don't think, like, I think they did mention though, like, you wouldn't be like, as long as you take action against it, like, you're not gonna be like pu uh, punished for it. So if somebody does come in, come on and say a slur, like, you know, like, it's not your fault. It's like their fault, and they're the ones that are gonna be banned for it, like, not you. Bro, I don't know why. I'm so talkative, even though, like, I want to progress in the game. Like, I, I want to be... Like, I'm fighting a war in my head right now. It's like, okay, Joe, can you actually fucking shut up so you can actually concentrate and reach back to where you were? And either half of me is like, no, I want to talk. I haven't been able to stream, like, early today, so I'm going to talk a bit more. I'm always tempted to get, like... Or, like commission my own, like, um, Sherry Arbor, like, bootleg merchandise, but, like, the only problem with it is, like, I wouldn't be able to really, like, you know, especially if it's clothes, I can't really just wear it, because I feel like somebody will question it eventually, and they'll be like, oh, what's that from? I'm like, uh, my light novel series, and, you know, but, like, when, when I leave here, and I go, and I, like, use my flesh form, you know, I'm kind of, like, a normal person, I have a normal face, and I don't really let my identity be known, you know? So it's kind of just, like, kind of awkward. And I'm just like, shit. Because even, like, 
man, I'm just thinking about that now. If I actually do somehow get volume one out and I have a deal with Comic Con to actually have my own little like booth to sell shit at, like I'm gonna have to be wearing the mask like the whole time, and it's gonna be so weird. Or I might even just like cosplay as like um, Joe Stout Flyer, like the green hoodie and all that. It's misery. Oh, so the misery. Everybody wants to be my enemy. Oh, here's the misery. I'm not gonna lie. Even though I like made Joe's like um, mashup mixtape to be like the final music thing that I sing on like the internet in general. Like I still kind of want to do it again. Like I want to make another like cover. Even though it'll be copyright claimed, and I'll have to upload it to like the archive channel. But then again, I always have thought about making a music channel. But again, at this point, like if I'm going to be stopping YouTube, what's the point in making another another channel? Like, I'd only make another another channel if there was a reason for it. <laughs> I'd just make a new channel called like Joe's Night Flyer Oscalga, which would mean Joe's Night Flyer in Irish. That'd be a funny thing to make, honestly, actually. Because, like, I mean, Mr. Beast does it with his channels. He makes, like, all his channels and, like, has them dubbed in different, like, um... Like, uh... Dubbed in different languages. Jesus, I couldn't think of the words. And, like, he's making bank off that easy, like... Like, bro, I heard, like, as well, he pays, like, um... Or he's hired, like, the fucking voice actor for Spider-Man in one of the dubs. So, like... When, um, when people hear fucking, oh shit, oh no, oh, mm. when people, like, for example, in Spanish here thing, they're like, I think it was Spanish, actually, wasn't it? Let's just say it's Spanish for the sake of it. So, like, in Spanish, they'll be like, oh, cool, it's this channel, what's it like? And then they hear the voice actors, or the dub actors, like, Spider-Man, they're like, wait, what the fuck? This is what Spider-Man's voice actor looks like? <laughs> Isn't that mad when you think about that? But again, the only problem with setting up so many channels like that and doing all the, like, dubbing and shit and, like, subtitling is the fact that, like, you kind of lose your anonymity when you go to another country. Like, it must be peaceful in a sense where, like, you know, if I were to fuck off to Japan, nobody would know who I am. But then again, I talk about myself as if I'm a big streamer. I apologize. <laughs> That's an ego now. Inside of me talking. You know, actually, I deserve that. I deserve that. But, like, let's say, you know, like, I had, like, fucking, what, like, a million subscribers on YouTube, right? And people were starting to recognize me when I walked out and around in Ireland, right? Like, if I went to Japan, nobody would know, like, me, unless, like, I have subscribers from Japan. But you're less likely to get noticed, like. Well, I say, you know, you, mm, it's a weird scenario. You, you are actually kind of more likely to get noticed because you're a foreigner in Japan. Because, like, there's a clear difference between my pale-ass skin and, like, an Asian man and woman, you know? And everybody else in between. It's, like... It's strange. I don't know. But honestly, it, it might be a thing. I might do it at some point. Just be like, fuck it, you know what? Like, if I ever do come back to YouTube, I'm gonna come back and I'll do different languages. <laughs> Actually, you know what? That, that'd be actually gas, right? I would, like... How funny would that... Oh, fuck. How funny would it be if I actually did, like, start learning Japanese? And the best way to, like, learn Japanese would be to dub my own channel in Japanese. I think that would be hilarious, honestly. And, like, the thing is about the channels as well. Don't do what, like, some, some other companies do and block, like, the content from appearing elsewhere. Let that content be available anywhere, right? So, like, if you're dubbing in another language, let that be available in everywhere. Like, don't let it just be available to Because, like, not all, like, Spanish people, for example, live in Spain. Obviously, like, some of them live elsewhere, like, in the UK, in Ireland, US, etc. Like, And some companies don't understand. It's like, if you were to make a channel like that, like, make that channel and, like, the language is available elsewhere. I know the Destiny and Bungie accounts do it differently, though. They use the one channel to upload, like, multiple different languages on the same channel. 
But after they've uploaded all those videos, they make sure that they're, I think, blocked um, in every other country but the country they're meant for, or countries. Which is a bit strange, but I kind of see why they would do it like that. But honestly, if people, like, heard, like, especially in, like, Destiny and whatnot, they're like, oh, there's a specific channel just for, like, my language? Cool, I actually will just subscribe to that one instead. Because some people don't probably subscribe to those channels because they're thinking, oh, it's probably just in the one language, like, you know? Oh, too much. I don't know why my brain cut out there. But yeah, we're going to be at this for a bit. Like, my head's already hurting. Like, with how long we've been at this, honestly. Ah, <sighs> oh, shit. Here we go. I guess I like talking, because, like, in a way, that, like... If I do actually completely cut off myself from making content, then, like... I'm probably going to have so much more bottled up like stuff that I need to talk about that I'm just not going to talk about. Maybe that's a good thing. Maybe a final actually, like, they, because, like, my parents are very open and, like, they're always saying, like, if there's something on your mind, just tell us. But, like, I don't usually worry them with, like, too many things. Like, I'll maybe mention the odd thing, but, like, not everything. A lot of time, like, I am, unfortunately, that kind of person that will bottle up their emotions and just, like, eventually it'll fizz over and, like, that's it. Like, that's the end of it, like. And then sometimes those thoughts and stuff will come back, but, like, it is how it is, you know? Okay. No, too little. I'm still doing it too little. You troll. You fucking troll. Why are you... No! No! I wasn't thinking. I was too busy calling myself a troll. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Like, again, can I at least make it up with the thingy tower, maybe? Or something? Oh, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm, I've been watching a lot of, like, nags recently. Like, a lot of his, like, streams, like... Or videos of streams are just gas. I feel bad for him though, because if I had a chat like he had, bro, I, I probably would have issues, like... There'd be no way I'd be able to survive that. Like, fella accidentally put on, like, tanning stuff or something like that, and like... He just got... Decimated for it. Like, the stream would not let it out. Even, like, in the other videos I was watching, people were still commenting on the orange stuff. I'm like, bro. I'm glad I'm a VTuber now. Because if I actually showed my face, I guarantee people would have an issue with me. Just every single day. There would never not be an issue. Oh, Joe, your eyes are a bit too droopy today. Oh, Joe, you still have bags in your eyes. Like, yes, I know. This is me. Just leave me alone. And plus, like, you know, when you have a VTuber model, you could be in any clothes. You could be in any form. It's all nice. It's all lovely. Like, for all you guys know, I could be completely naked, but I am not. Because you probably already heard I took off a shirt and put on another one. Bro, what is this urge? I don't... Bro, I'm feeling this weird urge. Just continue talking. Like, bro, Joe, it's cool. You've talked enough now. Just, like, calm down. Like, you can just... Like, you can just play the game. Like, there's, there's more to life than just, like, chatting all the time. Oh my god, bro. No. See? Oh my god, you fucking did it! Let's go! I finally cancelled out a jump. I I'm so proud of myself. Wait, can I? No, I can't. I thought, imagine if you could just press down and that actually would have cancelled the jump the entire time. <laughs> the amount of times I would have fallen because I didn't press down or something like that would have been mad. Yeah, um, I'm trying to think, right? Other than playing Jump King and Destiny 2 when next season comes around, I don't think I'm going to go back to Overwatch 2, honestly, on streams. Like, unless I really get into Overwatch again, but, like, I, I kind of only got into it a little bit, like, because the game re-released, but now I'm just kind of like, nah. Like, I'll probably play it during events, but I don't even know if I'm going to play it on stream or not. Oh, God. 
How the fuck did I do that? You know what? I shouldn't even question it. I should just be glad and grateful. And now I'm falling. See, I feel like the moment I learn how much, like, higher I have to go will actually just demoralize me and never make me want to play this again. That's why I'm not going to check it. Like, I'm just so scared of checking it. <laughs> In case, like, it's just like, okay, Joe, you still have, like, another, like, 500 streams of content, like, in this game to do before you reach the top. Nah. I, I just knew it was weak shit. There's no way that was going to make it. I'm glad I made it up there, though, honestly. Like, that's a GG moment and a half. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of disappointed that the Telesto event is just, like, a little thing. But, like, I don't know. I think it's funny that Bungie at least tinkered with the idea of doing a little mini event at the end of the season. You know, just to, like, tide people over for an extra week. I just feel like they should have done it more, like... Maybe they should have waited. They should have left, like... Unless, like... Unless the Telesto event is distracting us from the actual event that's gonna happen. <laughs> that would be so gas. Like, it's just like, oh, wait. There's more. But then again, Bungie did say there's no event. But I, th I think that's legit just being tied to the Telesto thing, though. I don't think that's gonna be anything else. Too little. I'm still doing it too little. I don't even know why. Ah! You know what I'd love to do at one point? I would love to just be in a room with Nick just Just to see what he's like. Even though I wouldn't be able to even, like, actually collab with him unless, like, I censored my face or something like that. Oh my god, you fucking troll. You absolute troglodyte. I actually, like, there was word before. I can't remember if he said it himself or if somebody said it about him. But, like, I swear someone somewhere said that, like, Nick Akado said at some point <laughs> that, like, once he reaches 30 or something, that he's actually going to just, like, stop doing YouTube. He's going to, account like, he's basically accumulated enough. And that he was going to, like, actually, like, sort out his, like, health and problems, like. Which would be interesting, I'm not going to lie. Joe, visualize. Okay, you're not listening, Joe. Visualize how long you wanna jump for. Okay, like this. See, those are little. Do a little one here, all the way. Little one here. Bit more. Bit more. I said a bit more, but you didn't even listen. better to was way too much I don't even know what happened there I seriously don't even think like buying from that shop is gonna make any difference honestly I just I'm just not bothered to try I'd have to get confirmation from someone and then I'd have to look it up to make sure it's not bullshit <laughs> Fuck. 
What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Are you going back down? You missed the old, the, the old man lick. I'm trying to remember what old man is in Japanese. I can't remember though. I'm just thinking about mother and all that. Like Okasan. Unless that's like grandmother. That might be grandmother. Do that too much more. Right, we're back in town. The boy is back in town. Boy is back in town. Doom. Do do do. The boy is back in town. Boy is back in town. Do 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 do. do, do. You know, actually, I'm gonna just stop that just in case I do get claimed, or like <laughs> this portion of the stream just gets muted, like. Because, you know, I have such an angelic, like, singing voice. Like, they'd actually mistake me for the actual singers. I seem to just repeat the same mistakes without learning anything. And I hate it. Like, my, sh my machine learning algorithm just turned off somewhere. And I don't know where it went. Or I don't know where it turned off, should I say. Because, like, see, it's more than that, Joe. It's more than that, like... See, so now when you go back up here, hold it for... Ah! I thought I was going to hit the block. Right, now as I was saying, hold it for a bit longer. You're too close to the edge, I swear. Too little bit more. I swear, out of the corner of my eye, I'm seeing something flicker on OBS. But it's not. Like, nothing's happening. I don't know why, bro. I'm going insane. I'm going insane, old style. Oh, my God. What I would do to have the talent just like an actual good streamer. Thank you. Thank you. Right. This should be like probably the last attempt before I just give up, honestly. I do kind of value my life in a sense. I say that, but I'm gonna continue doing it anyway. No, uh, brother. Ah, oh, man. Shy Lily brought up a good point during one of her VODs about, like, fucking... When she was reacting to videos and, like, she was laughing at something, but somebody had to put a spin on it being like, Bro, you shouldn't be laughing at that because this, that, and you're... I'm like, bro, I feel that kind of pain. I'm also scared to do that kind of thing. Like, that's why I won't just put on a random, like, meme compilation to react to. Because I'm just scared that people will be like, Bro, why are you laughing at this kind of humor? That's not funny. And it's like, bro. Like, it is. It's funny. You're just too sensitive for this world. And maybe you should actually have, like, stayed a bit longer in your mother's womb, if that were the case. too much. How do I have the patience for this? How do I have the patience for this? No! Y'all cringe nay nay mofos. Brother. So I think that's it for now. It just X's out, just like, no, I'm good.
Uh, no, but I am being serious, though. That, that's going to have to be it for now. I, I can't, no. <laughs> just, uh, I made a little progress today, but it's progress nonetheless. Twenty K jumps, fucking hell, man. Sheesh. Uh, I... Sure. Oh, excuse me. Right. There we go. Now we're just chatting. You're updating everything. Done. Okay. Right. So, firstly, what we're going to do for this little session is we're going to look up um, jump king speedrun, right? Uh, is this the normal one? I'm assuming this is the norm. Okay, we'll go into normal one, right? Like, oh, it's a god. And, like, the reason I'm bringing this up now is what we're going to do. Oh, my lord. Okay, I have kind of spoiled it a bit for myself. I was going to look at the bar and be like, okay, that's how far we're in. But okay, I guess we'll just know all of them. So, Red Crown, Colossal, False, Bar Thing, Great Frontier. Oh, shit. What? Oh, wow. We're like... Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. That's 9. So, we're basically halfway. Well, just under halfway through Jump King. That's actually more encouraging. I'm actually not going to lie. That's actually kind of epic. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I kind of just want to watch Sea Dog do it. I'm not going to lie. Right, let, let's see a champion at work here. Last one, last one. This is it, this is it. This right, is come it. on, the Connor. Show me, boys. show me what you got, Connor. This is it. Oh, I don't need 1080, run. actually. It's the last one. And the I'm, other reason I don't no. need 1080, by the way, is because, like, you know, the stream's only in 720. Like, it's not going to change from there. But yeah, obviously Chad, like, we need to look up, um, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Just have that queued up. Is it? No more. Now, I would speed it up as well, but like, you know, I am streaming, so I'm going to wait. Starting over is okay. If there's something I learned from being a chef, you don't want to be the one who pushes through after dropping the food on the floor. You need to restart <laughs> with fresh ingredients. Bro, his text to speech during his streams was so fucking gas. Like, <laughs> man. The actual, like, lore and stories that people had when they used his TTS, like, are mad. Some clear objectives. Let's see, where, where... Oh, so he just does little jumps for there. Music and food are a little different, though. That's interesting. You can you can keep going with music. You can't keep going with f bad food. Oh, he's already failed. Damn, imagine he's trash. <laughs> no, I'm joking, I'm joking. Bro, I've been down here so many times, I can't say a shit, like... You're right. Every time I tune in, it's Jump King. <laughs> and every time... And that's what I was talking about previous streams as well. Like, about, um streamers when they play this you feel bad for it like i, I kind of feel bad for the viewers of the streamer because it's like they're like oh yeah he's still playing jump game cool it's either the start i don't see the only other time you would feel that with me is when i stream fucking metal gear rising like non-stop honestly maybe for a charity stream i'll do that instead of fucking jump king dlc <laughs> imagine like if we just go back into it play the hardest difficulty right oh shit wrong button Screen or this guy falling. I don't know what's going on. Probably milking Twitch for content. <laughs> Enjoy the cashew slick courtesan. Thank you. I see. Even I do that now myself. I'm about ten seconds oh, behind. You fuck that. The rate I want to be at, but that's. Fine. But to be fair, so I again would fuck that so easily as well. Transfer that into. Oh, that's where you first meet the crow. Progress. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, you're telling me you could just- Oh my god, I- Again, 
I'm, I'm just going to keep some of this in mind. I'm not going to watch the whole video, obviously. I'm only going to watch up to when he gets to Great Frontier, basically. And I'm going to stop there. I just want to see if he does a lot of things differently or too oh many things God, different. Oh my God, what am I doing? That was the first oh, new thing I think he does different. guarantee jumps. Why am I trying to do them shorter? Hmm? What's wrong, Connor? That's... Bro, it's not the exact words I say, but that's literally what I think to myself, like. I'm about 20 seconds behind now where I want to be, but that's fine. If we do bargain bird. Okay, yeah, so time, he goes up here as well. Kind of makes up for it. He can always jump over there. Yeah, there's no other easy way. Okay, yeah, no, and I discovered that one. Oh, and he jumps over a little bit for that. If, yeah, it's a big if. Wait, wait. What? You can jump straight from there? If, yeah. It's Bro, man, the amount of time I've wasted jumping into that little box, man. Two different things. Two. Big if. Big if. Imagine he does something mad here. No, there's nothing mad. Okay. I thought he was going to do something wildly different here, and I was going to be like, bruh. Oh. No, I feel that pain. I feel that pain. That's legit me. Too much. Oh, no. That, what the fuck? That was just right? Hold on. We need, we need a play-by-play -play on that. Give me a minute here. I'm analyzing this shit. No, okay. No, that's fair. He, he reached in. Just for a second there, it looked like he didn't actually reach in. And the game was just being generous to him. Bro, if he doesn't do this in the first try, no. I'm gonna I'm gonna cry for him honestly. I think we're going to play Jump King again, again just real quick. Just, just just let me watch the rest of this. Just see how much farther he gets. Bro, oh, I, I didn't know. This. I didn't know. Bro, the amount of times I was here and I'm trying to get here when I could legit just jump out here. Bro, let's look at that again. Fella just skims out. And he uses that somehow as well. I think we can salvage this. And again, the reason I'm not going to watch the whole thing is because obviously I'm not... Like, I can watch this part because, like, it's fair enough. I've passed this part. But I feel like if I just watch the whole thing, I'll just know every shortcut and every cheap way to do it, like... And I don't really want to do that right now. So, yeah, no, he, he's probably going to finesse this, yeah. He goes to the very edge. Yeah, okay, so I knew it. So you go there, but I fell off, didn't I? Yeah, I, fell, I, I slid down here. So, we'll stop here. I'm not going to watch the rest of that. We're going to go back here, though. Okay, right. Um, <laughs> let, me just, uh, let, me, let me just open the Jump King real quick. I know we're meant to be in just chatting, but shush. Give, give me a minute. Give me a minute. I need to test this. Legend has it that there's a hot, or there's a smoking hot babe at the top. <laughs> Look at him already planting his face to grow. He's like, bro, I'm sick of this shit. Can we just stop? Right, I'm gonna replicate his. Okay, I'm not gonna re replicate it entirely. I forgot to do the little jump. Oh, yeah, this is one of them, wasn't it? So he just went here, didn't he? No, he did at the edge. Bro! That saves. <laughs> Oh my god. That saves me pain. That legit saves me pain. That's why I like it. Okay, this is just unavoidable. You can't do anything about this. If you just don't do this right, you just don't do it right. Like, it, it, it is how it is. <laughs> Wait, where are you? Okay, fine. Just go from here. My old methods and the new ones are, like, not meshing real nice right now. I'm not going to lie. Right, watch me struggle to get back into the church. 
Too much. No, too little. I okay. That 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 works. <laughs> that works. I panicked and it still worked. Too much. Too little. Jesus, fucking send me straight to hell, why don't you like? Like you might as well at that point. Like I'll do it for myself, like. No! Please! I just want to go up to the top and prove to myself that I can do the thing. I've already done one of the two of the fucking shortcuts. Oh, I didn't even do it the other one there, I just realized. Oof. Hold on, let me let me just go back down real quick. So you just have to jump here. Jump there. Wait, I can... Oh no, it's the third one, isn't it? Bruh. Again, it just helps, just to know that little bit of detail so I can save time in the future. Because, you know, the streams get real boring real fast while, when they're, like, really long and I'm doing the same shit over and over. Like this right now. But now that I've done that little bit of a difference, like, oh, Nora inactivated. He actually did something different. I need to think about this. And I also need to, like, log that in my memories. <sighs> Okay, there we go, up we go, up we go, up we... Frick. Dude, that's not, like, not cool. Like... A bit more. You're doing it too much! What part of too much do you not understand, brain? Cop on, like... It's not that hard. It's li like, look... Little jump? A bit of a jump. Full jump, too close to the edge, never mind. Okay, we're back in town. We can go here. We can just basically go straight back there. Okay, lovely, lovely, absolutely lovely. Just like my future wife will be. Lovely. And when I say wife, I'm referring to the hot babe at the top because I will never get someone in real life. Okay, lovely. Right, now we now we can test it. Now I like can actually do it. I can perform the test. Okay, if I actually want to do this. Okay. So you just like did a little jump, didn't you? You know, at least I'm here. At least I'm here. But I need to get used to that jump. Because it's not... I don't think it's a hard jump. It's legit just like... Probably like a tap. I've always been afraid of sliding, eh, sliding upwards. That I never thought that it would actually come to my advantage. Or be in my advantage. Be my advantage, should I say. Oh, fucking just send me down, like, just don't, don't toy with me, alright, Miss Nagatoro, just stop, it's not funny. I was thinking to myself the other day, like, out of the three teasing animes I'm thinking about in my head right now, because of just saying Nagatoro, I think Nagatoro has to be the best of three, like, when it comes to Nagatoro, um... Uzaki in the other one where they're in like middle school like the middle school one's just adorable the um, Uzaki is like I Don't know it's, Uzaki is just Uzaki, but like fucking Nagatoro is where the real comedy is at Fun fact, by the way, for anybody who likes uh, the anime Miss Nagatoro, uh, the person who did uh, uh, the person who like wrote the manga for it was actually writing like hentai. He was like, you know, I, I think the, the story was legit. It was just like, you know, what? I'm sick of making hentai. Let's just make an actual like manga, and obviously it popped off. 
But beforehand, they were, like, making a lot of lollycon stuff. Which is so bizarre when you think about that. How, um, like, a person legit just goes from, like, making, like, a popular show for when they were making, like, lollycon beforehand. Like, that is just, that's bizarre to me. That's like if I turned, like, Sherry Arbor's story from the story it is now into, like, an etchy story. Like, I just, I just wouldn't be able to do that myself, personally. And, like, if you were to do something like that with, like, Irish media, it'd be so weird. It'd be so unheard of. Like, nobody would, I don't think anybody would like that, honestly. I keep going up there when I don't need to. Oh, too much, no? But it comes to show, though. It doesn't matter what you're doing. You can always transition. So I think I know someone as well who used to do, like... He used to be in the JAV scene. So, like, obviously, like, prom. But now they're just, like... Well, they don't really do it anymore. That's it, like... Because I was going to be like, ah, now they're just a normal person. It's like, yes, Joe, they, they were always a normal person. They were just featured in adult videos. And adult uh, websites as well. Oh my god! Off we go. Off we go. I'm so determined to get up there and fucking do this. Like, I don't even want to actually progress farther than just, like, being able to, like, at least be able to do the uh, jump needed to easily get into thing. Oh, my God. Remember, Joe, if you fuck up up here, you can be... T yeah, like this. you got to be sent down. Why are you... Why? It's like getting a cake with a cherry on top and just eating the cherry. Like, you're not enjoying the full thing. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, my God! Are you fucking kidding me? Please. Just let me back up. I, I always overshoot it because I'm scared of fucking falling too far. Cause I, okay, yeah, no, okay, it's done, it's done. <laughs> it's done, it's done. I'm rage quitting. I don't care. I just don't care now, okay? I'll try and remember it for tomorrow, but I probably won't. Oh yeah, I won't be able to use it, will I? Oh, no, you don't. Oh, you. Oh, yeah, you can. Obviously, you would be able to. There, indeed. Um, who else am I thinking of? Yep, they are as well. I'm just checking people who are online and not. Oh wait, actually, yeah, I could just check the sidebar. Epic. Right. Anyway. Um. Right. So yeah, back to uh, Sea Dog. Obviously, we have to look at the best moment in his whole career. Um, did he upload it into his actual channel? No, nah, I don't think so. It might be somewhere, but obviously, Cow Clips is on top, so we'll just watch this one. And I think this one is a part of a DLC. I don't think that's the actual babe at the top of thing. But bro, his raw emotions in this. Oh my god. <sighs> Prepare yourselves. Let's go! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm stupid! I'm stupid! No! Oh my god! I'm boosted. Look, I'm so boosted. Look how far he's going! I... Look how far he went down, man! A full fucking 17? No, not even 17. 11 seconds dropping. Nah. Bro, I wouldn't be able to recover from that. I don't think there's anything else to rest with. I think he just completes it then. Yeah, he just completes it afterwards. But yeah, right. Let's look up VTuber and see what things come up first. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Right, what's interesting? <laughs> 
Uh, Nemo abandona el mundo VTuber. Oh, there's XQC. <laughs> uh, that actually kind of sounds gas. Hold on. One of the reasons why it's my favorite, and also is that Minecraft? It is really a oh, yeah, it's Minecraft. Uh, well, like Randomly, JP voices heard during one of his streams. Yeah, it sucks about this though. I know it's such a small. Oh yeah, I remember now. Bro, he left thing on in the background without knowing. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. XUC is also a gas guy as well. I'm not gonna lie. Imagine how confused like you would be if you like you're just like um you just speak Japanese, you just start seeing English in the comments like <laughs> Emo Oh man, this fucking chat man, I'm out. Hello <laughs> Nice to meet you. Wild wild people Worldwide people. <laughs> Imagine how confusing that would again, just again, just the confusion on that. Just the fact that like you're just going about your day and then you just start seeing like I I yeah and just seeing things. Like... Nice to meet you. Hello. Just typing it without knowing what it means. It would scare me as well, I'd say. Think they're coming from a famous streamer. Is this spam? Your English, <laughs> your English, lol, man. Uh, L plus ratio plus your English, like, that's that that's a big bro memento. Wait, hold on. Let's see, where are we going from here? Is there any end cards? Nope, no end cards. Okay, I guess we're gonna scroll from here. Um, bu -bu -bu -bu. for the apocalypse woke up thing. I'm trying to think, um, I don't know. I just, I could just put on nags right now. Just, just react to him reacting to VTubers or various clips. Um, hmm. see now I'm in a, like, I'm stressing out. I'm like, shit, I should probably play something soon. <laughs> oh, excuse me. And this is why I don't watch long clips, why do I? Like, I usually just watch, like, if a clip is, like, over two minutes, that's when I'm like, okay, it's a bit long, like. I don't know. I think I'm actually good for today. <laughs> it's just like, I was actually expecting to go a bit longer, but I guess not. Hmm. Dum ba dum ba. Bum ba dum ba. <laughs> don't know if I can watch too much of that. <laughs> Um, yeah, no, I'll be careful of what I like watch on stream. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know how YouTube will take to some of what I'm looking at right at right now. Oh man, can I find? No, I want to watch that one real quick before I go. I'd love this fucking actually. Um. Baggles, I think it was. It's such a good animation. That's it. No, is it? Yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, this one. This is it. I fucking love this clip so much. This clip is just... Oh my god. Well, this animation in general is just so gas. Right, let me just... Boom. So if you don't know um, Baglets, that's it. Baglets like does a lot of like um, animations, as you can see there. A lot of them involving Iron Mouse and Sea Dog, and I think there's a few others as well. I just haven't perused a lot of the content, but like, it's it's just gas, especially the fucking reactions like um, Connor got out of fucking Iron Mouse during the stream. This shit is just so gas. I'm coming. I'm coming. <gasps> Connor. <laughs> Okay, look, there's numbers. One. This is like a door of the Explorer Backrooms Edition. Can you <laughs> do it for us? Hola, amigos. Yep. 
Oh yeah, she was saying as well that she's going to get a Dora model. That's going to be strange. Because I think she just recently showed that she got another model. Oh, anyway, sorry. Dora. I just thought I'd mention a little bit. Say, say, say it! One! One! one. Very good! Can you say... Dun 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 No, you go ahead. You got a real, you're real quiet there from when this opened up, huh? I think you should go ahead. No, 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 go ahead. I don't want to, I don't want to... By the way, can we admire the height difference as well? The, the, it's very accurate to a certain degree. Um, actually, it, look, we'll say it's like 80% accurate. It could be a bit shorter, but that's just me. Like ruin, that, take all the fun away. I mean, I... Rawr! There's nothing out here. Open the door. <laughs> no, I don't want to open the door. You open, the door. <laughs> open the door. Open the door. Connor, please. Be, be brave. You that's be where the brave. animation Why do I want to be the brave one? Maybe I don't want to be the brave one today. <laughs> okay. I kind of want to play the Iron Mask role today. And I love in particular as well, that moment just there. It's just like, no, obviously because it's Jojo, but the fact that like, the uh, backlit also like put on like Connor's cosplay as Iron Mouse, like on him for this. I don't want to play the Iron Mouse role today. That's if, class. If I could slap you in this game, I would. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go and smack the monster. Go and slap him. Give him a little slap. What slap is that? <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> <laughs> Stop with blocking the doorway. <laughs> <laughs> And there's your man himself. And if you notice as well, where is it? Hold on. Yeah, see, that's why it's the most replayed, because people are just, like, trying to read the title. It just says, Mom, Bagless is self-inserting himself in the animation again. <laughs> this maniacal laugh from him, like, the fucking One Piece reference as well. Can we get much higher? So high, oh, 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 God, sorry. But yeah, no, I'll just say the, like, best animation I've seen in recent time. And then they also, like, left a little teaser that there's going to be, like, a little Minecraft animation soon with Nyaners and Aethelstein as well. Right, anyway, sorry, enough of that. Enough of me fanboying over VTubers for today. Jeez, what the fuck just happened to me? I, I, I swear I saw something flick. I, I think it's just the post-it now. I think I'm too cautious right now. Yeah, no, this is why I also just don't react to videos and stream. I just feel awkward when I, like, start watching videos and stream. Especially, like, videos and shit that I like. Because, I don't know. It, it's, it, it's strange to open up about things I like and whatnot. That, like, I think I shouldn't be opening up about or something like that? I don't know. Maybe I'm finally getting the sense of maybe I shouldn't just tell everybody everything that I like and know about, like, just in case. But anyway, thank you so much for watching this uh, stream. We progressed literally, like, probably a pixel in Jump King today, but you know what? That is still progress. Um, Obviously, if you want to, like, keep up to date on when I stream, make sure to follow now. And you can actually decide what next uh, game I'm going to play next, because that's the next follower goal. But other than that, if you're watching this on YouTube as a VOD, make sure to like the VOD if you like the comedy if you want to subscribe. If you want to hit the bell if you do so desire. Make sure to also uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel to get... Well, I'm not, I don't even know if I'm going to do it all the time, but I'm probably going to like say sometimes that I'm like streaming through like um, the new YouTube post system. But yeah, also keep an eye on it on that. I actually might post like more teasers about Sherry Arbor's story and stuff on that and not just like Twitter and whatnot. But yeah, anyway, thank you so much again for watching and goodbye.